What is going on everyone? I have been absent from the world for a few days and I apologize. It has been raining for four days now and I am unfortunately vulnerable to the weather because my GoPro is not waterproof. The case is, but I drilled a hole in it for my microphone and blah blah blah. So I can't record in the rain, which is unfortunate. But today's beautiful. So I thought I would go out and make a little vlog. And it's the day before I leave for Arizona. I leave tomorrow at some point. I have to go to San Diego today to help a friend build a computer first. And then stay there for the night. And then yes, go to Arizona. Change my oil today because I have reached 4,000 miles. I was gonna change it a thousand miles ago, but uh, I don't have a lot of free time, honestly. And getting it done somewhere is relatively expensive if you go full synthetic. It's like a hundred and hundred bucks, which is relatively expensive. I could probably pull more out of it, but you can feel it when you're shifting with the clutch. Once your oil starts getting dirty, and I can feel it a little bit. So I figured it's time. Hmm. He was nice. What is going on over here, Black Toyota? You're a good driver, yes you are, and you're on the phone. You are just all kinds of impressive. I'm going to be cleaning my bike thoroughly before leaving. I gotta spend a solid hour or two cleaning it up. I was so sad because I cleaned it last weekend. It's looking really nice. And it fucking rains this entire week. Really black car. For some reason, I'm not one for speed limits and all that shit. Like just crossing double yellow lines bugs me for some reason. Like I will not do it. I think I've ever done it on the video. I don't think I've ever done it on one of the videos. And I've never, not that I can remember, I've ever done it either, so. I don't like it. Don't know why. As I do this. Well, that was nothing actually. Whoops. Sorry, black car. So I was saying, oh yeah, I cleaned my bike and it rained. And now it's all water spotty, damn it. Very sad times. And then I had to clean my chain practically every single day because of the rain. Ugh. Then your rear tire gets all gunked up from your chain loop because you use too much of it because you're afraid it's going to rust. Yep. So the, the uh, what are I looking for? First world problems? Close enough. It wasn't my original idea, but it's close enough. Let's see what we're dealing with as far as traffic is concerned. Not. I would like to be right here. Holy shit, I'm going 100 miles an hour. When the hell did that happen? I thought for sure I was only going about 80. Damn! God damn it! 105 and a half miles. Shit. I always feel bad if I don't acknowledge the fact that they let me pass. I feel like it's being an asshole if you don't. Ow. Oh! Speaking of ow, I was riding to work one morning, it was this week, it was in the rain. 
and I was about to get off the freeway. I was going about 80. And I see this, this little black thing approaching me at a very rapid pace. And it turns out that the car in front of me, you know, it was a solid 100 feet in front of me, fl like flung up a big old rock. And it got me right in my collarbone. I, I thought I broke my collarbone for a second because it hurt so bad. And that was through my jacket and through the, the strap of my backpack. It was, it was kind of impressive and really painful. So beware of flying objects while riding, you guys. Because rocks hurt. I wonder if this is the train that goes to Canada. Oh, I'd imagine that would, oh, hello. But, ah, I'd imagine that'd be closer to the beach though for a better scenic route. You are a pretty car. You should come do fun things with me on the freeway. I don't like express lanes, damn it. I have to always get out of the carpool. Makes me sad. I thought you were the white M3 or M5. Damn you! Oh, that hit. I was harassed by the police a couple days ago. I was not writing. I was actually going over... There's a, there's a spot I like to train at when I get off of work. You know, I get off work at 11. I get there about 11.30, midnight-ish. And uh, this is training, you know, just parkour. My my main hobby. And fucking, I got there, got all my gear off, and it, it had just finished raining, so it was all wet and really cold. It was midnight, and I was taking my gear off, and I see this this random guy poke his head up from like the distance, then just trying to flashlight. I was like, what was that all about? And I waved at him, like, okay, that's kind of weird. And then oh, only breathe. Shit. Shit. <laughs> and so... I, uh, I just, I know, I kept taking my gear off, put on my sweats and my, my 510 shoes and all that. And sure enough, a cop car pulls up, and they, uh... You know, they were cool, they were younger, you know, night shift cops, all that, blah, 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 and, you know, they come up to me, and they're like, any weapons? I'm like, mm, nope. Drugs? Nope. Mind if we do a full body search? I'm like, well, I guess. So that was my first time getting fucking seductively groped by a cop. That was fun. And then we started talking a little bit. I'm just like, yeah, it's kind of weird to see a to see a kid out here at midnight on a motorcycle in the rain. I'm like, yeah, I figured as much. That's a nice KTM. So that was kind of fun. It was it was an experience, that's for sure. And then there was traffic. Oh, I thought that was an FRS for some reason. My eyes have gone to shit. Still nice, don't get me wrong. <laughs> Welcome to California Freeways. It is chilly. It is definitely becoming winter. It took a sweet ass time. It's already at the end of November. End of November. It's so bumpy. See, son, here I am. Uh, All right, guys. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. And if you want to subscribe, then I will see you guys next time.